to me about this bill. This is uh, essentially criminalizing religious beliefs. And I don't mean to speak in hyperbole here, but if this bill were to pass, would this uh, prohibit the sale of the Bible that teaches these things about sexual morality? Well, literally, according to how this law is written, yes, it would. This is, you know, PC culture, politically correct culture, gone horribly awry. This is really directly hitting at our First Amendment rights as American citizens. Now the Democrat legislators in this building right behind me, the California State Legislature, they want to tell you how to think, what sort of books that you can read, write, and purchase. It is completely wrong. It is absolutely against our First Amendment rights. And I, for one, will be a vocal opponent against this if it ever hits the assembly floor. Right. I mean, some of the phrasing here, I read it. I read it in the introduction. I want to read it again. They say this uh, this includes efforts to change behaviors. I mean, that is the role of parents to guide their children's behaviors. If they are not allowed to guide their children's behaviors with uh, their religious beliefs, then what what rights do parents even have in the state of California? Which is exactly right. I mean, this is what the Democrats are trying to do in California. This is how bad it's gotten, how far away the California Democrat Party's actually gotten away from even just normal Democrats here in the state of California. They want to tell people how to think, what sort of books they can read, what books they can't read. Remember, this country is founded upon the freedom of expression, and now the California Democrats want to take even that away. Right, and, and tell me, I mean, you're in the assembly, you work with these people, I know you respect your colleagues, but who is behind this? This is the whole liberal agenda. I mean, this is what they've been trying to do now for, for decades, literally in California. It's just gotten so bad because no one's been able to stop the Democrats in California that now their true designs are, are, are really starting to show themselves. This is all of the Bay Area liberal elite group think. Thirty-nine of the last 40 years by the Democrats in California. They have super majorities in both the Senate and the Assembly. It was only broken recently by their own expulsions over sexual harassment allegations. So, I mean, look, it's not as if these guys are a clean house. These guys have been trying to do this for a long, long time.